I don't really feel too well today. Um, senior Jedi was sick the last few days, the day we went swimming, and she got sick, so may have caught a bug from her. We'll see how it goes, see how long it lasts today. But uh, I'm gonna hop on the Sky Train, and I'll see you guys shortly. here in Edmonds, gonna sky train in. Got some meetings here on Tuesday. And um, get to work. some meetings but I'm gonna have lunch first because I'm really hungry and then head over to the offices and meet also don't forget it's action Tuesdays which I'll get to shortly but uh, I'm gonna enjoy the weather like I said I'm gonna eat now and get to my meetings so guys I just had my week number two lesson with Tim Schmoyer and the video labs crew um, Wow it was really really cool um, like I said if you're getting into YouTube or the business of YouTube or trying to understand YouTube you gotta check out his page and you gotta take some of his courses. I bought his book, I've got a whole bunch of his exercises. Um, they've totally helped me out in terms of my YouTube channel, my YouTube business. Again, I'll put his uh, link in the description and make sure you go check out his YouTube page. It is absolutely helpful. Um, he's such a great guy and he really understands the business and he really understands YouTube. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Thank you. So I'm here to pick up my wife and my lovely kids, but the lovely kids are out of the playground. <laughs> they'll uh, be here any second. Will they be here? Yeah, they'll be Hope here. Hope they have their stuff with them. Yeah, well, I'm not going back into the building to get their stuff. So yeah, well, we'll see. They'll have to make do. No, they should have because they've been at the park most of the day. Oh, really? Yeah. Hi. <sighs> my, uh, my time. community wants to know what you do. Are you able to tell them what you do? <laughs> I told her she should vlog I have, on her own. I have two jobs. Yeah, she's got two jobs. I... One big child, me, <laughs> and then two other children. Well, yeah, it's a full-time job looking after a family and a home and, mm -hmm. you know, working full-time. It is. So it's a lot of work. I don't think, uh, I don't think people who People who don't do it don't appreciate it. How do you find juggling working and being a mom? You have to make sacrifices, of course. Would you change it? Uh, no, because they are so precious yeah. and so priceless. They are, right? Yeah, and you know, I enjoy work and I don't want to give up work, so... 
Yeah. You just gotta kind of find that balance, right? You do. You just gotta find that balance. And you know, you pray that one day your beloved husband will be a little more hands-on, you know, a little more, uh, yeah. yeah, just a little more domesticated, a little more hands-on. And you also pray that your kids will remember what you've done for them when they grow up to be rich and famous, <laughs> that they take care of you. Yes, yes. Let's All right. hope that will Invest happen. in your kids. No, you know, it's important because I'm sure people, you know, that may watch this will be in the same situation where they don't know what to do. Do you quit work? How do you juggle? No, I, I think it's it's a tough one because I enjoy working, so I don't want to quit work. Yeah, um, but it's teamwork, right? At the same right? time, yeah, but at the same time, you know, it's, uh, it is sacrifices, right? Like, we don't socialize with... We never have date nights. We haven't had a date night in like 10 years. Well, that's not true. We haven't made time for a date okay, night, which we should, okay, right? Okay. Right? But we're going well, to. By the time you're, you know, by the time it's like you've done everything that needs yeah. to be done with kids and the house and, you know, grocery and the cleaning and the errands and whatever, it's like, who is the energy after that, right? No, so true. But, um, it, you know what, it, it's, it, it can be done. I mean, we're lucky we've got you know, good daycares in the area. We've got good daycare. What would be great is yeah. to have more family hands-on help, right? So, you know, just drop the kids off with family and escape for a few hours. Yeah, for sure. Where anyway, I thought this vlog was about you and that's... No, it's together. about the family. Oh, I see. Even though it's got my name all over it. Yeah, that's <laughs> what I'm thinking. Hey guys, we had to do a quick stop at a uh, grocery store uh, because we needed groceries. Thought it'd be easier to do it now and then... Uh, you know, instead of doing it later, because uh, I don't like coming after I'm home and comfortable, changed, and then come back out again to get groceries. Um, but I do have a spectator with me. Oh, look at her. She's all. She's knocked out. Poor thing. Yeah, she gets up really early. She's an early bird in the family. Selena, she um, gets up at like, oh, like 6 a.m., crack of dawn, and ask for milk you know it's um it, it's funny you know um you know what my wife are talk my wife and i were talking about uh regarding you know making time for a family and i harp about it all the time in my vlogs and stuff because it's really important you know these are precious moments um, with your kids you know whether it's yourself or with your wife you, you got to get out and do stuff together and part of action tuesdays which i'm going to explain now is you know, in the previous vlogs, I went to, on a Sunday night, I went to Starry Night, a community event. You know what, I've never been before. And to be honest, I never really did community events just because, you know, life is busy, right? But what I want you guys to do is check your calendar, go on your local municipality or city's website, and take a look at the community events and plan something for this week or this weekend. Just jot it down, just think about it, write it down, pick something, whether it's, you know, a barbecue they're doing or you know, whatever it is that they may be doing at, at you know, at some park or maybe some swimming thing. You know, there's so much stuff going on in summer. I'm sure you can find something in your local community to take you and your family to. So your action for today is to get on the websites or, you know, the community magazines or newspapers, find something, jot it down your calendar, and please make an effort to go check out a community event with your family and kids, okay? Do it, trust me, you'll thank me later.